Nevada education leader is a step closer now to giving all students an extra hour of sleep, pushing back start times. Thank you for joining us at 6. I'm Brian Loftus. I'm Denise Valdez. The Nevada Board of Education, though, is facing a lot of criticism from school systems, including maybe even being hit with a lawsuit. 8 News Now education reporter Joshua Pagaro here to tell us what's next. Brian, Denise, the State Board of Education is meeting right now as we speak regarding a change in start times that could begin in August of 2025, and it's been a lively debate. Currently, classes at CCSD high schools started around 7 a.m., but the proposal is to push it back to 8. The board president says there are several studies showing an improvement to mental health and academic performance for students who get an extra hour of sleep. Yet the majority of school systems in Nevada oppose this move and say the board is overreaching its authority. Even if we had the most amazing teacher in, on the planet teaching at 7 a.m. and the kids are just like half asleep, are they really learning? What is our intent? Kind of like what, where are we going with it? Because I, I just worry that we're going to try and in the process of trying to do it, there will be more unintended consequences. CCSD says these changes, if approved, could impact school bus schedule, and they have threatened a lawsuit if the Board of Education moves forward. CCSD's transportation director has previously said all start times uh, it, that this could impact elementary school students from accessing breakfast until 10 in the morning. All right, so I know you've been covering this for quite some yes. time. This was first proposed, uh, gosh, I think back last fall. This is by no means a done deal, but what happens next after tonight? So tonight they have to agree on two options. And one option is that the school, the, the, the school state superintendent will decide whether or not, um, will decide the schedule for the school districts. And then after that, they will have to present this sort of change to the state who will decide whether or not it's legal. Uh, so there's still several okay. steps mm -hmm. and several roadblocks, including from CCSD. And you're saying they're getting a lot of pushback, so we'll see what happens. We'll see. Okay, Joshua, thanks for that.